The underwater ecosystem in Florida is in trouble with a growing population of the invasive lionfish. With no natural predators, their numbers are quickly rising. Foreigner Corner's Chris Day joins us in the studio with more on what's being done about this problem. Chris? Well, Kelly, it turns out the solution may be something many people are glad to help out with. All people want you to do is eat. Today, Lee Reefs and the Heights Foundation tried to introduce the fish to the bellies of southwest Florida. You know, in southwest Florida, we, we have some pretty good chefs out here, and they've done a fantastic job, so I couldn't be happier. Several teams of chefs from different restaurants around southwest Florida came to compete in a cook-off. But what they're cooking, you might not have tried before. We got a chance to sample some lionfish, and that was my first time trying it. I got to tell you, as a judge, that was one of the hardest contests I've ever judged. The lionfish, a non-native species introduced to the Gulf of Mexico, has exploded in population, wreaking havoc on the native fish. Hopefully man can start to be their predator and help keep their population down. The lionfish population seems to be going up and up and up, you know, so we need to do something to get rid of them. Since the lionfish has a small amount of meat and can be difficult to catch, not many people have tried it before. This group hopes to change that. The reviews are in and... Oh, they're, they're great. They're good fish. Yeah, they're very mild, very mild fish. Uh, that's why so many uh, dishes can be made with different seasonings for them. They're not overpowering or anything like that. Really good. For the past month, Mike Campbell has been hunting these fish to serve, but he's hoping others will step up to the plate. 200 fish off the reef. We've got a lot of people here that know that these fish taste good and um, you know we're working on getting the commercial industry involved so that's that's the goal. Mike Campbell's done a great job on trying to promote ways to get rid of them and uh, he encourages everyone to try to do what they can. And eating them is one way. That eating is one way, yes. Now to find out how you can help control the lionfish population and how to properly cook the fish We've added that to the story on our website, fox4now.com. Live in the studio, Chris Day, Fox 4, in your corner.